your exclusive AccuWeather forecast from KTVO. Well, looking ahead for tonight, some chilly temperatures in the forecast. Right now, though, right now, though temperatures are falling, 33 degrees in Kirksville. We topped out actually at 48 degrees here at the station. Humidity levels 49 percent, dew point 16. Winds are out of the south southeast at eight miles per hour. Much cool, much warmer in Atumwa, 41. Humidity levels 34 percent, dew point 15. Winds are out of the south at 12 miles per hour. At 6:15 this morning, mostly clear skies across the area. We saw a lot of sunshine for today. However, as we headed into the afternoon and more so in this evening, we are going to see an increase in cloud cover, but that's actually going to help our temperatures. Uh, we woke up to this morning into the mid to upper teens. Well, for tonight, we're going to drop down to about 25 degrees as your overnight low. So that the Cloud cover is acting like a blanket, and it's going to hold the heat in closer to the surface. So that's a good thing. Winds are out of the south at 5 to 10 miles per hour. Low, couple low pressure systems, again, very slow moving, moving off to the north and to the east, not affecting us. High pressure moves back in to keep us dry for the next few days. However, we are seeing some colder air moving in behind this low pressure system that's actually all the way up into Canada. This trailing cold front will slide in on Friday, dropping temperatures just a few more degrees, but we are watching a lot of moisture that is moving up from the southwest, and that will affect us on the weekend. Tomorrow's high, 44 degrees with partly sunny skies. Northwest winds 5 to 10 miles per hour. Tomorrow night, north winds 5 to 10. Very little change as far as the temperatures. Just a couple degrees cooler, 23 degrees with partly cloudy skies. And looking ahead for the weekend, well, again, all that moisture that is filtering in, that will affect us as we're heading very late Friday night, more as we're heading into Saturday. Right now, it's about a 70, per, 70 to 80 percent change of rain. Now the thing is, as temperatures fall below freezing late Friday night, we're going to see a changeover from a rain to a rain-snow mix. But if you are traveling to the west, into Nebraska, Kansas, and even into central and northern portions and western portions of Iowa, you're going to be running into some snow. But for us, we are going to remain on the wet side as far as rain is concerned. 40 degrees as your high on Friday. We'll start out the day with mostly sunny skies, increase in cloud cover, chance of showers moving in late, 70 percent chance of rain on Saturday, 43 degrees with a changeover of a rain-snow mix. Late Saturday night temperatures falling to 27 degrees and a chilly day on Sunday. 35 degrees and we'll see partly sunny skies and then a few degrees colder on Monday back to work and school 31 we'll see a mix of sun and clouds of course you can get your forecast 24 7 and weather forecast delivered right to your inbox just click on subscribe it's free at the top of the home page of heartlandconnection.com so again if you're traveling this weekend especially Saturday night you just need to be very careful we're creeping closer to winter and you I can tell it, it can't you definitely All right, thanks Teresa. Coming